Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Tech, and in today's video we have some great news for Samsung Galaxy S24 owners. This is for the S24 Ultra, S24 Plus, and the S24. The One UI Beta number 4 is being pushed out in certain countries, and right here we have a change log. Now if you look at this change log on the top, we actually are getting two brand new features that are coming directly from the S25 Ultra. So let's dive in and see exactly what is going on. Now you may or may not get this update right away. It is being pushed out in some countries like India, but it's not available yet in the United States. What I have right over here is a screenshot of the update log for One UI 7.0 Beta. Now first let me show you the two features you're gonna be getting that's gonna be brand new. So here's the S25 Ultra, it's running One UI 7.0, one of the major features of the S25 was this thing right here. When you go to your camera and you tap right over here and you go to your settings, you are able to go down to advanced video options and you are able to access this log video mode. So when I tap on this one, you're going to get this exact same option in the S24 Ultra. So you are going to be able to access the log recording mode in pro video mode or the video and pro video modes. So if I enable both of these guys and if I go back into my camera, okay, and if I go to video, let's go to pro video first. So here's the pro video. You're gonna see the log option on the top. When you tap it, it's gonna activate the log option. Now here's a slightly better angle so you can see exactly what happens when you tap on the log mode. So if I tap it again, you can see, you see the regular colors, but if I tap it again to activate that, you'll see the log overlay. So it kind of looks like a little bit washed out. So when I record a video, let me just record a video for a second here, maybe for three seconds. Now, if I go into that video, all right, it's gonna look just like this. But when I swipe up and tap on this option, also an option you're gonna see on your Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra, you are gonna be able to tap on this and it's gonna correct the colors. So you're gonna get a very well colored video. Of course, you can take this video and put it into a video editor and you can do some advanced color grading. That's the whole point, okay? But you will get this option uh, where you are able to swipe up and see the correct color option. The other thing is when you tap on more, you are gonna be able to go into the pro video mode and you are, you are gonna be able to do the same exact thing. Again, log option on the top, you tap it. Okay, you can see the HDR gets disabled because log is even superior to the HDR mode. Again, it's gonna look washed out, but once you edit that or do the color correction on the phone, as I showed you guys, you will get rich detailed colors or you can do it at a video editor for even more advanced grading. So that's feature number one, you are getting for sure with the One UI beta number four update. Number two, it says added AI filter in camera, okay? So that one is this one right here. Again, if I go to my camera, and if I go to photo mode, and if I tap right over here, you can see we have a bunch of filters right here, and you can find this in your S24 Ultra right now, but with the latest update, you'll get this plus icon right here. And when you tap on the plus icon, it brings up your recent photos and you can pick specific photos so you can apply the same coloring scheme found in that photo to your current photo. So for example, if I want to use this filter right here, I would tap on it and that would apply that filter to my current viewfinder. You're not gonna see it because it's sitting flat on the table so you see black background but you would see the, the filter of this black and white photo applied to the photo I'm about to take. So if I pull this back, now I am using the filter that I picked from that photo. So this screen, the AI filter screen, is going to look a little bit different with this newer beta update. But overall, this is great news because this means S25 features are coming to the S24. Maybe not all of them, but some of them, and the lock feature is in fact a big one. Now beyond that, if you look over here, 
This is just a bunch of bug fixes, UI fixes, some simple stuttering fixes like the fingerprint stuttering fix. Uh, you may or may not have experienced this, not a huge deal, but the two big things are the two new features that are actually added to the S24 Ultra with the latest beta 1UI 7.0 update. All right, guys, any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below, let me know. For now, have a fantastic day.